In 2020 alone, 2,200 billion text messages were sent. Texting has quickly become the most effective and useful means of communication, which means that nowadays, users are demanding more and more from their messaging platforms. So that's why I built Pi iMessenger. Hi, my name is Rupert Patel and I'm a junior at Strawberry Crest High School representing the 15th Congressional District of the State of Florida in the 2021 Congressional App Challenge. For my submission, I created Pi iMessenger, which is a simple iMessage chatbot which allows users to execute certain functions through their text messages. This adds much needed functionality to just simple texting. It's built using the AppleScript programming language, the Python 3 programming language, the SQLite programming language, and the Pi Qt5 bindings. The backend works by constantly querying the iMessage database and then looking for any command prompts. Those command prompts are then processed by the Python code and a response message or image is then sent back to the user using AppleScript. So here we are with Pi iMessenger, which when turned on opens up a small control panel. From here, you can monitor the amount of messages sent, the extensions which are enabled, and additional settings which can be toggled on or off. So if a user were to send a command message, such as slash ping, the computer would send back a response, which in this case is pong. And we can also see that the message sent counter has also increased by one. Users can also create their own extensions, adding further flexibility. So for example, I created the slash doggo command, which when received, sends a picture of a cute dog back. There's also additional functions, which pull up the news, flip coins, and send cool space photos. Your imagination is truly the limit for what you can create with Pi and Messenger. Homeowners can use this to turn their lights on and off. Businesses can use this to quickly allow customers to make orders. And hobbyists can use this for their own personal projects.